How to Catch the Tooth Fairy Written by Adam Wallace Illustrated by Andy Elkerton All is quiet, all is still. The clock shows 3.09. The bell goes off. I'll go to work, cause now's my time to shine. I'm the Tooth Fairy, yes I am. And every single night I collect 300,000 teeth while staying out of sight. My travels take me far and wide. My life is such a blast. But please don't try to catch me, for I'm really much too fast. Nancy Catans, I recall an important fairy rule. When you are taking someone's tooth, watch out for all their drool. Johnny Withers sets a trap. He wants me in a box. I'll take his tooth and then for fun, I'll hide all of his socks. Cotton candy, love the stuff, but I won't try to eat it. Every trap that's set for me is sure to be defeated. Julie has a good idea, a trap made out of floss. I'll get her tooth and leave a coin to pay her for her loss. As I fly to Taylor's bed, I notice something scary, but once I've tied it all in knots, I'm feeling rather merry. This trap is good, I'm quite impressed. It nearly did me in, but I've got golden fairy dust. I'll never let you in. Ooey gooey catapult, fire's marshy mellow yum. It doesn't catch me, but it does just slightly stick my bum. Lights are off in Sarah's room and traps are everywhere. I'll need to do my fairy best to fly safe out of there. Now Sanjeev is creative. He's made a special cage. Am I no more? Is this the end? You'd better turn the page. Then at last I'm home again. The teeth are safe and sound. The kid who'll catch me in a trap is still yet to be found. Can you catch the Tooth Fairy?